What's wrong with you? I'm just stressed out. Exactly. Everybody's busy. I don't know. And this I mean, might end up being a disaster, but I don't know. Oh, I cooked dinner tonight. Mm -hmm. Thank, Thank you. Welcome. So who's having soft shell? Who's having hard shell? I want soft a hard shell. shell. I do not like hard shell. I'm having a soft shell and a hard shell because I really want both. Okay. I'm gonna do a lot. A lot. I wanted to now share with you guys what the product is that we have. You're probably wondering what is this big black bar behind me? <laughs> I'll explain all that in a minute. Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. Right now we are finishing up with homeschool. Aiden is almost complete. Bradley has taken off and left the kitchen, but that's okay. She had to go upstairs and finish up her video they filmed. It was supposed to go up yesterday and it never made it. Mom, that's okay. Look what my favorite YouTube channel has. What? Oh, cool. And then, and then they have um this. Oh, that's neat. Yeah. So anyway, we are getting ready to leave um, in just a few minutes. Oh my gosh, Charlie's eating Charlotte's food. Get him. Go get him, bro. He loves puppy food, and I don't understand. I think it's just because it's not his. It's something different. So he wants to eat her food. On today's agenda, we are planning to go back to PetSmart, take back the outfits that we bought, because if you guys watched yesterday's vlog, <laughs> you saw they did not work on those babies. They were running all over the legs, and... Charlie like a deer kicking his back legs out. <laughs> it was pretty funny. Um, we did go get all the grocery shopping done last night. I don't think I even clarified, but you guys saw us at the grocery store. We have pretty much everything for about to Valentine's. What is wrong with me today? Hey, Kayla. Hello. What's wrong with you? I'm just stressed out. I'll tell you about that in a minute. Anyway, so we went and got all the shopping done for Thanksgiving because, as you guys know, it's this week. It's going to be here in a couple of days, and we had to get ready. Tomorrow, we're going to be doing a ton of cooking. ton. Because I like to have mostly everything prepared the night before. So then it's more like heat and eat kind of thing the next day. So we can have more time to enjoy it and not feel like we're in the kitchen all day long. Yeah, we're going to head to PetSmart. Kayla's filming a really fun video after we return the baby's outfits. It's gonna be about the puppies, but we're only gonna take one puppy, and she hasn't decided who you're taking. Yeah, Do you know, know who you're gonna take yet? No, I don't know. Oh gosh. Okay, she's doing that challenge where you take your pet to a pet store and whatever they touch, you buy. So she wants to do that challenge, and I think it'd be fun, but I told her with two puppies, number one, it's gonna be really expensive. Number two, I don't know if they would just play with each other the whole time they're in the store, or would they officially shop? You know what I mean? So I don't know. And right now they're in there playing. I don't know if you can see Charlotte oh, there back you there. Are. I was trying to look for you upstairs. Hey, were you looking? Oh, uh -huh. she was outside in the backyard, babe. Yeah, I know. Uh -huh. So back? she's a little stressed out. Real quick on that, um, she has a photo session. Another one tomorrow that's going to be Christmas related. We had a beautiful location picked out. The lady that's got the property has contacted Kayla and said, yes, that day will work, blah, 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 but we can't come up with a time. Kayla has messaged her, called her and everything, and now she won't return to phone calls. So the photo session is tomorrow, and we need to lock down this time, or there's gonna be no point going out there, because you go out there, then what's gonna happen if she doesn't have somebody there for the property? Yeah, I mean, like, you know what I mean? I'm not just gonna walk on someone's property without no. getting full permission. full permission. She said we could use it. <laughs> she said okay. But we're trying, we're trying to lock down the time, and that's what she's not letting I've been messaging not, her know. since Saturday. Saturday, she didn't read my message. I messaged her Monday. I called her today, and I'm like, I don't know what to do. I've tried calling other properties, and just for backup, no one is answering their phones. It's the it's a holiday week. Exactly. Everybody's busy. I don't know. And this I mean, might end up being a disaster but i don't know i hate having to move their session again i know that oh my gosh i don't know it's just like i'm stressed out you know what don't stress um i saw them they were late they were rain over there oh nice. they were up here i think on the bar right there can you hand him his gloves briley yeah. what are you doing bro thank you instagram okay are you about ready yes okay you need to pack up your school and take it with us we're going to take school on the road because, like I said, I need to go run a few errands. Not only does she need to go to PetSmart, I have to do a few things myself. And yeah, I need to make a list because I forgot things yesterday. I told you guys I didn't make a list. I went to Target, picked up a few things, and totally left off a few things. So, I'm like, man, tomorrow, my goal, I don't know about you girls that are busy on your phones not paying attention to me. My goal, it's okay, my goal tomorrow is to not leave this house. 
at all. Oh no, we don't really need to. I don't want to unless you have to go do that session. Oh yeah, we do. That's, that's the only thing. Because I would love to be able to just stay home, get the house completely cleaned up fully because I started and it never got finished. Yeah. And then um, I want to get started cooking and I don't want to be up all night doing it. So if the photo session is a fail tomorrow, then we'll probably just stay home, do nothing. If not, then we're going to have to leave again tomorrow. I'm like, is there ever a day we just stay home? I don't think so. So we just left PetSmart and did the little challenge Kayla did with Charlie. It was a lot of fun. <laughs> it was kind of crazy, but he would not touch anything. He walked in the straight middle of every aisle and didn't even go near anything. I'm like, you're the best dog ever. You know what I mean? He was like so good. He like didn't even want. I was like, this is going to be a total fail. And then eventually, I mean, we were in that store for like over an hour. An hour, yeah. And he didn't touch a lot. Then it got really good where he started touching everything. And I was like, slow Look at the down. Cat. <gasps> it was a kitten, wasn't it? Now we are done with that challenge, so... Good job, Charles. You did good. I have to go by the post office because I'm mailing out my Christmas cards today. I'm so excited to send them out finally. Yay. So we're sending the Christmas cards out and then I need to go. I want to go wash my car. Although it's supposed to rain tomorrow. My car's just really dirty. But a few things still on the agenda and Aiden says he's starving. And we did get good news. I don't feel as stressed anymore. Oh yes, After she heard back from her people she was waiting for. And messaging, I got a response while we were doing the challenge that we are good for tomorrow. So good. Ugh. So we've now made it into a Walmart and we got a few things in the car. I need a wreath for the front door. And I think I'm gonna hot glue the ornaments to it. I love the flocked look, but none of my greenery outside's flocked, so I hope it still looks okay. And what are you up to? Instagram. <laughs> Instagram. All right, I think we're about done. Look, I have like a few more things to get. Oh yeah, he found this for $1.99. It sticks right to his phone. Look, this is what it looks like. Oh, this is cute. It looks like cool? that, and like I can do like, uh, okay. Just don't let it fall off, okay? Oh yeah. Oh, this things I'm addicted to. My phone, my bed, coffee, checking Bradley a story every second. Oh, that's actually a pretty filter. I know, look how pretty that is. And that was like look a, there. always Bradley, I saw them this morning. I just followed them. Did you? Shout them out? Yeah, I'm shouting them out right now. Okay. Anyway, so we're going to finish this up and then we're going to head home. Come here. We're getting dinner ready. I came home and actually had to clean the entire kitchen up. It was such a mess. Such a mess. Dad's on the way home. You can add that and add a little bit of water, stir it up, put the lid back on it. All of it? Yes, every bit of it. Then um, put the lid back on it, put it in here for about three minutes. Actually, make it four minutes. I'll be right back. Where are you, Matthew? Um, come on. Stir it. Where are you? I'm gonna get you. A little more. You need a little more than that. So, anyway, like I was saying, we're home trying to get dinner prepared. But I have something really cool to show you guys. I'm super excited to share. We got a package today, and. I'm just excited. The kids are excited. They're like, can we do it now? Can we do it now? I'm like, no, let's eat dinner. And then we're going to show you. So I'm going to let Briley finish up on dinner. She's going to prepare that. We're having tacos and tortilla chips tonight. Kind of a quick, simple dinner because tomorrow night we'll be in the kitchen all night cooking for Thanksgiving. Okay. Yeah, put the lid on. Like four minutes. Clean that and then we're going to put the tacos. I'm going to let your brother help with the taco shows up here. And then we'll cook them for about five minutes. Alright guys, so that's it. Stick around, don't go anywhere because like I said, I got a really cool product to show you. So we are about to sit down to dinner. I was showing Kayla my new tripod. You like it's it? It's really cool. It looks like yes. really professional. I'll start taking that photo shoot. You could. I mean, it's actually like sturdy enough for that. If they were like all standstill pictures, that would be the perfect like setup. Yeah, see we have the ring light that we normally do like, we use that as our tripod. But sometimes you just don't need that extra light, and I don't want it to True. look like the extra light. I want it to look more natural anyway. So it's and like it's more flexible. Yes. Oh, it does a lot more. Plus, I can sit this on the counter if I'm trying to get a cool overview shot or something like that. So 
I like it. And it's sturdier than the ring line. Sometimes oh you have that whole yeah. cord yeah. running, the dogs running around. We're so scared one day they're going to rip the cord with them. <laughs> yes, oh, that's true. Because, yeah, when it's plugged in, yeah. The dogs is like, really nice. And it came from Walmart. It was $34. I know that's kind of pricey in my opinion, but not really when you think about a good tripod. It could cost you over 100 Oh, yeah. This fun. size. And it goes up to like six foot or something, I think. But yeah, yeah, it was good for taking pictures and everything. Else. Like to take our family Christmas cards. Yes, because we're always like propping it on a chair or the couch. Self timer. Yeah. yeah. So or this whenever will be Bradley nice. Cooks. Or whenever Bradley cooks, we yeah. Just probably never. Oh, I cooked dinner tonight. <laughs> she made everything. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're so who's having soft shell and who's having hard shell? I want a hard shell. shell. I do not like hard shell. I'm having a soft shell and a hard shell because I really want both. So. Okay. I'm gonna do a lot. A lot. I also have chips. Okay. We have tortilla chips. Is it good, Chef? Mm-hmm. He said, I am not eating tacos, but he's eating tacos. Okay, we're all done with dinner. It was great, and everybody's full. So, I wanted to now share with you guys what the product is that we have. You're probably wondering, what is this big black bar behind me? <laughs> I'll explain all that in a minute. So, Van Cayo was super kind and sent us a home projector to use to watch movies on and all kinds of things so we're going to be unboxing this and that's why this is up because i'm going to put the projection screen that they sent as well they sent us a portable projection screen which is really cool um my husband's already said we're going to be having some summer movies because that'll be so much fun but yeah just for now because it's too cold to be outside we're going to do this in our house and really excited to unbox this for you guys so thank you so much for sending this to us we really appreciate it and i can't wait to open it so let's get to it okay so this is what the box looks like you just saw this of course we'll go ahead and open it up Ooh, comes in its own carrying case how nice is that oh my gosh it's like really good quality as you can see, it comes with the little straps on here so you can make sure that everything's nice and secure. I've already taken those off. On this side right here, this is pretty much your power cord that it comes with. Oh, it comes with a remote. How cool is that? And a cable, I'm guessing, to hook up any device or a certain device. I'll find out shortly. Oh, it also comes with these. Oh. Oh my gosh, guys, that looks so nice. Look at that. Yeah, I guess this is how you can zoom in, zoom out. It has a bunch of different ports over here. Has a headset, AV, HD1, HD2, and a USB. And you can put an SD card in here. That's pretty cool. And then the power. But yeah, we're gonna get this all set up and show you guys what it looks like. Okay, so real quick, wanted to mention to you guys, I was just going through a few other things that I found in the case. It has like the user manual in here. It also has a quick start guide. And I was looking at it just to see what all you can do. You actually can use this with your computer, a tablet, your smartphone. Um, I believe it works also on gaming systems. So if you have a gaming system, you can do that as well. So you can probably play your video games on it. How cool would that be? They'd be like every kid's dream to have it that big, right? It also looks like you can hook your TV box to it, a DVD player. Okay, guys, we have the screen up. It's really big. I already had this, I was telling you, but you can hang this pretty much anywhere. It did come with some little hooks, but you can also purchase a stand like this. I got this one pretty cheap off Amazon a long time ago, right, Riley? How long ago did we get this stand? Um, that's it was musically. musically. Mm -hmm, like two years ago, maybe almost three years ago. About three, so I was like, oh, perfect, I have the perfect thing. But this is a screen, and we have the projector here. It does have a little turn on the bottom, so you can raise this up, put it at an angle. We did have to put it on some books. I know we probably need to have a better setup, but for tonight, it will do. Correct, guys? Okay, so I'm gonna turn off the light and show you what it looks like. Ta-da! Who's that lady? <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna play it and let you guys see the quality. As you can see, guys, the quality is really, really good. Some of our bed is in it right here, but it's all good. The quality is great. The speaker actually plays through here, so that's cool. It's got a good speaker, and it may even go louder. I just haven't tried it yet.
completely recommend this. Like, as you guys know, we are movie watchers in yeah. this house. And this is going to make for the best movie nights ever. So the kids have already said, can we watch The Grinch tonight? I'm like, sure. Because, yeah, it's going to be good. I'm already enjoying it and love it. I think it'll be even cool if we could set up in the living room. Yeah. But we do like to curl up in the bed and watch movies, so it is kind of cool having it here. Now, Kaylin's <laughs> already said, we need to rearrange my whole bedroom just for the projector screen. Well, oh. because, like, if you're laying like this, you have to lay sideways. If the bed was over here, it's like the perfect view. Like, you wouldn't even need a TV in here anymore. You, you can would. just have the projector. <laughs> so, thank you guys so much at Van KF for sending this. Yeah, we're super excited to have it. I know we'll get a lot of use out of it. And I'm not sure if I mentioned this, but this is the Leisure 470. So guys, that is the end of today's video. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. Leave us a comment down below and subscribe if you're not. And we'll see you in our next vlog. Bye, Bye. guys.